doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. Whatever we do, we do it together. All right, let's jump. You dive into the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. Wow. Who would have thought that someday I'd really get to visit Redstonia, Eligard's capital city of engineering. Incredible. Do you think Eligard will be willing, you know, to help us? Yeah. each and every one of you. Your hard work inspires me every day. Jessie, there she is. I am about to enter my dome of concentration, where I will be unreachable for the foreseeable future. But I will emerge when I complete my latest and greatest creation, the command block. I, uh, I think I'm gonna hold off on the whole going first thing for a while, Jessie. How about you take this one?
Was that... The amulet, yes. <sighs> Wait, are you gonna jump? The jumping is the easy part, it's the landing that's hard. This one's mine. You're asking for more? Jesse! Hey, ugly! Watch out! Hey, bonehead! I'm talking to you! Anytime now, Jesse! Shake again, just once for the road. The redstone wrap, you got it. <laughs> A 
I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. everyone onward that's really not necessary I'm just trying to be encouraging You're 
always looking to one-up us, aren't you? That is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Yeah, I don't race so much anymore. Bad, bad knees. Hope that fighting helped you work up an appetite, Petra, because you're about to eat my dust. Oh, big words, Jesse. Hear that too, right? Almost sounds like a waterfall. that one, Jesse. Let's maybe get inside the mansion before we pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? That front door's definitely a no-go. <sighs> Stick with me, guys. was some creepy guy in the window he had a white pumpkin for a head white pumpkin no such thing as white pumpkins 
Let's save the agricultural discussions for inside, okay? <sighs> Great! There's no door back here. Why would there even be a fire world? <gasps> Thanks. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Well, here it is, the competitor village. Sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep. At least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Wow, that's just horrible. I know. Mm. <laughs> they didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm gonna go confer with Otto. We go way back, and well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait, we still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. <sighs> I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines, which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Hadrian always was one for maximizing useful uh, productivity. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. We gotta get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. 